and there are big concerns over medical supply shortages in our country. What would happen if we ran out of ventilators? Well, as our Catherine McGinty tells us tonight, there are options. The Nueces County Health District reached out to Del Mar College to begin a program that would take CPAP and BiPAP donations and convert them into machines that could be used to help save lives. CPAP and BiPAP machines are generally used for people who suffer from sleep apnea, but they can be converted into closed circuit systems and used as ventilators. However, Dr. Kim Anufrak with the Nueces County Health District says using those machines would be a last resort. In the meantime, the best thing we can do is continue social distancing. Help see the curve go on the downtrend so that we won't have to use the CPAPs or the BiPAPs. That's only in, in an emergency setting. We really don't want to get that to that point, um, but we are going to be prepared. Del Mar College tells us they are working with the county to finalize the details of this program. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Catherine McGinty, Chris 6 News.